Hello, and welcome to the Bottom Line Bulletin. In this week's issue, we hear how HMRC is turning up the heat on accountants, what the future may hold for troubled BP CFO, and why shareholders are rocked by a chairman's past. The chairman of HM Revenue and Customs has warned it will launch criminal prosecutions against accountants who have hidden clients' money in offshore tax havens to dodge UK taxes. HMRC has given British investors in tax havens such as Liechtenstein a chance to give themselves up in exchange for reduced penalties. But it is now poised to turn up the heat on wealthy tax dodgers and their accountants. In an interview with the Accountancy Age HMRC acting chairman, Dave Hartnett said it was building a detailed picture of a small minority of rogue accountants. James Owen's future as FD of BP's troubled Russian joint venture may be hanging in the balance city watchers fear. As one of BP's most senior UK executives still posted in Russia, one analyst said it remained to be seen whether Owen would be forced to leave the country after Chief Executive Robert Dudley made his exit last week. BP told accountants the age that Owen was staying put and would continue as CFO of the joint venture. Utility company Northumbrian Water has been heavily criticised for failing to disclose in its annual report that the company chairman has stepped down from the role at Collapse Bank Northern Rock. Northumbrian's chairman Sir Derek Wanless was previously chairman of the Audit and Risk Committees at the Rescued Bank. The protest from shareholder consultancy PIRC could result in difficult questions for Sir Derek Wanless at the water company's AGM this week. The concern emerges that a director may have been tainted by involvement with Northern Rock and that the chairman was criticised in the House of Commons report in January. That's all for this week. You can find all these stories and more at accountancyage.com. I'm Rachel Singh and this is the Bottom Line Bulletin.